Hello there, this is Jesus Esparza. Well, I've just been waiting for the, the new Spin Master Monster Jam line coming out, and now I finally found them at Target. So yeah, yeah, these are the new Spin Master Monster Jam, and I got more right here. There's Megalodon and um, Pirate's Curse right there, because I, I don't have any room, but... Oh man, that's kind of strange. There's, right now I have Moxima Dalmatian, Max D, El Toro Loco, Wonder Woman... Bounty Hunter, Megalodon, and Pirate's Curse. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I have more. More, right? I have more, so I'll be do that in a bit. But right now, let's let's t let's take a review of those kind of those Spin Master Monster Jam die cast and what I have here now. But here, let's get started. This one's Moxima Dalmatian. Yes, it does have... It does have a tail now. Yep, and yeah, and everybody's um talking about the ears. Um, it should have been good that for a little bit, but you know, but it's still pretty good, you know. Yeah, I like the yeah. I heard like um, I think Mark Galloway, known as Lego Fan Five Hundred Six or something, that tells about um about the ears should be um a a little bit lower, a little lower, so. So yeah, that's right. I had to agree with that. So yeah, but at least we have a tail. So yeah, it's still pretty good. And make it trying a bit a bit more accurate or something. Yeah, I still have the Monster Mat Dalmatian and Mattel one. So yeah, this is Mat Hot Wheels and Mattel's Monster Mat Dalmatian right there. This is Mattel's and this is Spin Master. But yeah, well, I had to choose only one. But you know. So I don't have it because I don't have many. I don't have much room to make. So, yeah, I guess it, we're now moving to the Spin Master era. So, okay, yeah, either Monster Dalmatian Mattel ones or the Spin Master, but yeah, well, it doesn't have a tail. the t The tail on the Mattel's Monster Dalmatian version and the Spin Master does have a tail. See, like this. That one's tail. No tail. Tail, no tail. Tail. So yeah, Spin Master wins and bah! out of the way. Spin Master does Spin Master wins and yeah. Mon Monster Mat Dalmatian of the Spin Master has a tail and the ears, but yeah. This needs to be a little bit lower down, but it's still pretty cool. So yeah. Next up, move that out of the way. Ooh. Next up. Max D. This is the Max D of the um, Spin Master. Yeah. The Spin Master the Spin Master Max D it was does could look look accurate, but everybody's been wondering about the spikes. You know. Yeah, the spikes, but you know the reason why to do this is because um, you know, they they don't want children to getting hurt or something or very causing painful or or kinda like the spike the spikes will be like, you know, when you when you grab them and boom, that's gonna be very painful. So yeah, yeah, that's how the spikes. Um, yeah, it's because for safety, for safety, you know. Remember, you gotta respect that because it's because they don't want children or anybody else for getting hurt while they're playing. Um, yeah, because it will be getting very painful. So yeah, and this is a Max D. Um, and um has a um, nice nice looking um and here is um the Hot Wheels of Mattel's Max D. Yeah, as you see the differences and yeah. Yeah. Everybody would feel like this one, but you know Yeah, the reason why for safety because they don't want children getting hurt like like, like this or or like this or something. Yeah, 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 it really is, but, yeah, this one a little bit spiky, but, yeah, they don't want children, children or anybody else getting hurt, so, yeah, okay, this, and, and this one, um, the light, the lights here, so, let's see the differences, and, and, um, let's see, make it the top of it, or, like, whoop, 
trying to make a handstand like this. Hmm. You okay, might see the differences, but yeah. That's pretty neat, but but Spin Master wants it again. So yeah. Well the Mattel's Mac the Mattel's Max D looks pretty good, but but the but the Spin Master made it look good, so we're now in the Spin Master era that we are moving forward, so Okay. That's been eliminated. And this one's the El Toro Loco, the red one. So, yeah. Yeah, I'm trying to find the El Toro Loco Mattel that I still have, but I don't have time for that. But This is a Spin Master El Toro Loco. It looks pretty neat. And the horns looks very a bit detailed. And yeah. This is, um, it look, had a, a little bit of flames on it, but yeah. Looks great, and yeah, I kind of like, I like this one. The Spin Master El Toro Loco. Yeah. Here's Wonder Woman. <clears throat> wow. Wonder Woman. Yeah, Wonder Woman of the Spin Master Mods Jam. Well, I bet they're Warner Brothers in DC. The Monster Jam just still, still contract with them. With Warner Brothers DC, but... And I heard about Spin Master, Spin Master in DC Comics are making a three-year deal for making toy, um, toys or something. Where hopefully if they could bring back Superman and Batman or even Man of Steel so they can make them into the Spin Master 164 scale trucks. So yeah, that would be pretty awesome. But right now is Wonder Woman and um, here's... um. Here's a Mattel, Mattel's Wonder Woman, and then let's see how the differences looks like. And hmm, yeah, the whip and um some other bit of details or something. Yeah, sure is. Oh, and and there we go. Hmm, I wonder how the difference is, but yeah. It looks pretty good. The Mattel one it looks pretty good, but but the Spin Master did it a bit better. Yep, yeah, Spin Master. Yeah, Spin Master did it great and way better and more accurate. But yeah, yeah, I just want to move on. I don't want to go a bit too long. Okay, this one's Bounty Hunter, Bounty Hunt, Bounty Hunter. Yeah, Bounty Hunter. Yeah, this is a Spin Master ones. Wow. I cannot believe they're gonna be doing some of independent trucks and owner some independent trucks who will be in Monster Jam, but yeah. If only imagine if some independents who did compete in Monster Jam, if they could join with Hot Wheels Monster Trucks Live, so so if they can make their fantasy trucks there or even or even the WWE um trucks to promote it to promote it, a WWE Monster Truck Show, imagine that, but yeah, but this one's Bounty Hunter, but, well, my, like Monster Jam OCD um, has mentioned, um, it really does not quite like the, this kind of Bounty Hunter that we've been, want, we've been wanting it, but probably they could make some flashbacks of Bounty Hunter or something, but yeah. Mm, this is a Bounty Hunter of them with a skull, kind of like the Punisher. Reminds me of the Punisher or something, but yeah, TexasTruckWorks.com on it, and mm -hmm. in the front of it, and yeah, this one, Bounty Hunter, and then okay, this next one is this one is Megalodon, yeah, Megalodon, yeah. Good thing I got the Spin Master one. I didn't get the Mattel one, so. Uh, trying to focus that. There we go. Yeah, this is Megalodon. Is made it more look accurate than Mattel's, but yeah. It's a very nice looking shark, like the yeah. It's it's kinda neat. The fins. That was nice. <clears throat> and then finally Pirate's Curse. Hell yeah. Hey Kyrie Zane. <laughs> Yeah, Kyrie Zane versus Pirate's Curse, or 
This should be a mix max mix match monster challenge, huh? Kyrie Zane and Pirate's Curse. <laughs> yeah. Let's talk about Pirate's Curse. Yeah. They have made it look accurate than Mattel, but yeah, that's very nice. But hmm. here's a Mattel's on Pirate's Curse. Yeah. You see the differences. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, this really is horrible because it doesn't look accurate to us. Not even a hat or anything. It really does not look accurate. Of the Mattel's version. But but the Spin Master fixed it. And Spin Master did it very amazing. Yeah. Spin Master just owns Mattel. And um. Yeah. And um. Yeah. The Pirate's Curse. And um, the hat. The hat looks accurate. And that's very perfect. And um. I'm not sure anything else, but yeah. All right, you're gonna walk the plank. See, Mattel has, I mean, Spin Master beats Mattel once again. You're going to walk the plank down. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <coughs> Sorry, I have a bad cough, but yep, Spin Master has ones it. <laughs> yeah. Okay. These are ones that I had, but I still got more. So, I'll be back. Alright. I got the, the dope. You know, kind of like the Demolition Doubles that Mattel's. That Mattel and Hot Wheels made. But in the Spin Master, they just call it Double Down Showdown. Double Down Showdown of the two-pack of the Hot... Of the Spin Master Monster GM um, trucks. Yeah. Well, Mattel has Demolition Doubles of their two-pack... And now Spin Master and Monster GM having Double Down Showdown pack as their two pack trucks. All right, let's start here. This is a Grave Digger and Wildflower, but yeah, there is a Grave Digger of the um, the single pack, but I like to prefer this one. So that way, um, I had to choose on I had to pick the one and only, the one and only Grave Digger, um, one sixty four scale truck. I had so that way. So I don't want to don't want to make more. Um, so I don't have any much room. Don't make don't take much shelf space or or drawer space or you know you know anything like that. But you know, but there's no time for that. But there's Grave Digger and Wildflower. But yeah, yeah, most yeah. I had to agree with Monster Team OCD because about the Wildflower. But you know, does not look accurate. But you know. The grill and all that, but 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 it's still pretty cool. Yeah. Let's see if they can make time flies somewhere in the future, maybe. Yeah, wildflower, first time ever. And here's some grave digger. But you have the Mattel's grave digger right here. And here's um the spin master grave digger. Kind of look the same, but different brand different brand. Mattel's Hot Wheels, Spin Master Monster Jam, and yeah. Hmm. Oop. Man. And the back of it looks like, and yeah, it does look pretty good. Looks accurate. So yeah. Mm -hmm. That's how the difference. That's how the difference this is, and that's pretty neat. But this is what Spin Master wins in. Uh, or something. Yep, Spin Master did a great job on that, so. Yeah, I don't have no words to say, but just want to review it and all that, but. And there's Blue Thunder and Storm Damage. Yeah, Storm Storm Damage looks accurate. Yeah, square body like that. <laughs> and Blue Thunder. Wow. This kind of Blue Thunder looks accurate than Mattel's, but yeah. Good thing I didn't get the Blue Thunder Mattel's version because it does not look accurate. Glad I got this one from Spin Master. And Storm Damage. Oh yeah, Storm Damage looks pretty great. Oh yeah. There's the brand new Brodozer. Monster GM's first ever diesel powered truck. So yeah. This is Monster GM. And, and um... Yeah, this is from the Discovery Channel pack or something. From Discovery Channel. 
Diesel Brothers Brodozer and Fast and Loud's Gas Monkey Garage. And yeah, this is a brand new Brodozer and that looks pretty cool. And, and there's Gas Monkey Garage and yeah, like Monster Jam OCD that, that, that Spin Master did more detail than Mattel's. And yes, they just completely. But Spin Master has completely owned Mattel in this one. So yeah. See, this one Mattel should Mattel shouldn't make this shouldn't make it more detailed of the Gas Monkey Garage and any other trucks. So yeah. But Spin Master did it, and Spin Master wants it, and Spin Master has defeated Mattel. Yeah. This is um Bro Dozer and Gas Gas Monkey Garage. And now Dragon and Jester. The purple Jester. Oh yeah. Let me bring you right here. Yeah, this is a dragon and and um Jester. Well here's a dragon from um like um like you know like Sting or um Dragon's Breath or um Betty King or the or or any like that. Yeah. This is a dragon from Mattel's, and now in Spin Master, they made this kind of dragon. Looks a bit different, and yeah, but it's still pretty awesome. Which is debuted on Overseas, and all that, and yeah. Hmm, that's how I look the differences, but... Mm-hmm, dragon. And here's Jetster, the purple one. Yeah, this is the purple Jetster. Looks awesome. Yeah. That's how it looks like. And, well. Really, Alright. Well. That's all That's all I can say on my review. About the Spin Master Monster Jam. And, man. Wow. I cannot. I don't have no words to say. But now. Well. What do you think about. The, the new Spin Master Monster Jam. Oh, uh, yeah. Looks awesome. And Spin Master? Spin Master is beating Mattel right now. So, yeah. Wow, they made it more look accurate than Mattel. And, you know, just what do you think? So, oh, wait. I'll just open one and I'm going to do the um, demonstration to see uh, what's my track to, can I, what might be using it on my sign up series. Okay, I had a bit of demonstration. Let's see if if it can fits on it can fits for my sign fits a track for using for my sign up series. And yes, it does fit. So yeah. Mm hmm. As you can see, um, this is how what we looked like, and um, and um, yeah, it's kind of been a little a little wide, but yeah. And let's see, um, how it goes to um. You know, to go down and let's see. Well, <laughs> that was nice. Let's try that again one more time. Okay, here we go. In. <laughs> That's very neat. So now I could create my sign up series for, you know, in team, um, like a teams, like Team Hot Wheels Monster Trucks and Team Spin Master Monster Jam. Yeah, probably I'll do that in my next sign-up series. In my next one. Alright. These are all the kind of... The Spin Master Monster GM. And, you know, in a single pack, that includes have um, the list that you, that you already have. And... And, um... It does include a poster that says Monster GM on it. <laughs> that looks pretty cool. You can hang it somewhere and, you know... I don't know. I have, yeah, I have too many, too many of these, but yeah, I just need only one, but, or maybe one for the, for the checklist, one for the checklist, and, and, and one is for like just a poster to hang it somewhere, and does include the kind of drive, the driver figure or something, yeah, oh yeah, one more thing I'm gonna forgot. Will the Spin Master Monster Jam will fit on the Hot Wheels Monster Trucks? Um, um, I don't, I couldn't remember to call it, but the truck thingy for the 
you know, if it can fit, yes, it can. It can fit there. Yeah, let me um, put it. Well, almost kind of, but almost kind of, but yeah, I well almost, but I don't think three, two spin master monster teams and hmm. I guess you have to do only um a two two spin master monster GMs and one Hot Wheels monster truck, and um you know yeah I made it look fit so yeah that's what everybody's wondering, but yes it can fit. It might might be fitting for only um only two spin masters on each two spin master monster GM. On, on each side, and one Hot Wheels monster truck. On 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 behind, but yeah. What well, might happen? Um, this, but what might happen to put the, the one Spin Master behind it? It won't be fitting. So, yeah. That's how the difference is, and the, yeah, it will be fitting, but you have to put on, okay, two Spin Master monster GM truck here. And one Hot Wheels monster trucks right here. Hmm. Well, I'm trying to I wanna check something in the bottom. Alright, I put the six spin master monster jam trucks on the bottom, but yeah, this kind of fit, but you know, it just might gotta be falling down or a bit squeezed or something. Let me try two spin um, four Spin Master Monster GM trucks and two Hot Wheels Monster trucks and 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 there you go. That's how that's how it looks like. Yeah, sure is. That's how that's how you should put those um Spin Master Monster GM and and Hot Wheels Monster trucks just like that. So it sure is. Well, what do you think of the? The new Spin Master Monster Jam, um, 164 scale trucks. Yep, we cannot wait to see the battle. It's like the Monster Truck War, like the Monday Night Wars, WWE versus WCW. Yeah, <laughs> it's like that. But this one, it's the the Monster Truck War is on. Spin Master Monster Jam versus Hot Wheels Monster Trucks. Yeah, Spin Master. Versus Mattel. Yeah. Which side are you on? And yeah. And don't forget to like this video. Comment what you think. Subscribe to my channel. Share. And don't forget to tap the bell for notifications. And I will see you soon.